Hello all the students. Today we are going to discuss in proposition logic some important topics like tautology, contradiction, contingency, satisfiability, unsatisfiability, validity. So let's start with tautology. So what is tautology? A tautology is a compound proposition which is always true. So if I take an example to show what a tautology is, suppose I have a proposition P and the negation of P which is called as not P and then a compound proposition that is P or not P. So this is a proposition, this is a negation of proposition which is also read as not P and this is my compound proposition which says P or not P. So if I look at the truth table of this uh, tautology, there is a single, prop uh, uh, there are two input variables. So P will either be true or false. So not P. If P is true, then obviously not P will be false. And if P is false, then, then not P will be true. So the result of P or not P. We know in case of or, even if one truth value is true, then the resultant truth value will always be true. So P and or P, that means true or false, the result will be true. Then P and not P, false and true, the result will again be true. So the compound proposition here, which is P or not P, is completely true. The result of the truth table for the compound proposition here is completely true for all the values. That means this is a tautology. Now, if I look at a contradiction, what is a contradiction? Contradiction is a compound proposition which is always false. Now if I take the same example where P represents proposition and negate P or not P I have, then P is true and false. So when P is true then not P will be false and when P is false then not P will be true. So now here if I take the compound proposition P and not P. In this case, we know that in case of and, both the truth values of the input variables must be true, only then the result is true, otherwise it will be false. So here I can clearly see that not both the truth values of the input variables are not true. When one is true, other is false and when one is false, other is true. So that means true and false gives me a false. Again, false and true gives me a false. So for both the uh, outputs or for both the results or for all the results of the truth table, the result of the compound proposition is false here. So this compound proposition is false for all the values. So this is a contradiction which is completely false. There is not even a single truth value uh, in the truth table. There is not even a single true truth value in the truth table for the compound proposition over here. So this is a contradiction. Now if I talk of contingency, so a con contingency is a compound proposition which is sometimes true and sometimes false. It is neither completely true nor is it completely false. So it is sometimes true and sometimes false. So if I take an example for a contingency, then if I have two input variables P and Q, so true, true, false and false, then true, 
false true false then if i have a compound proposition p and q so the result of true and true will give you a true then the result of true and false will give you a false then the result of a false and true will give you a false and the result of a false and false will give you a false again so here you can see that the truth values for the truth table of the compound statement p and q here neither all the values are true nor all the values are false so some values are true and some values are false so such a compound proposition for which in the truth table you have some uh, truth values as true and some truth values as false is known as a contingency now we will look at what is a satisfiable proposition statement or what is satisfiability so let's look at satisfiability so the satisfiability says that a compound proposition which has at least one truth true uh, value in the truth table or a compound proposition which has at least one truth value by at least i mean even if there is one true truth value then it will it will set it uh, uh, then we can say that it is satisfiable so the concept of satisfiability says that any compound proposition which has at least one true truth value in the truth table is said to be satisfiable so by according to that i can say that a tautology is satisfiable because we are saying that even if one true uh, one uh, truth value in the truth table is true then it is satisfiable and in case of tautology we know that all the values in the truth table are true then a contingency is also satisfiable because what did we say that even if one truth value in the truth table is true then it is said to be satisfiable and in a contingency we know that some truth values are true and some are false that means we have some truth values which are true so that means a contingency is also satisfiable now one thing that you should uh, note here is that every uh, uh, tautology is satisfiable but not every satisfiability is a tautology because as per the definition of satisfiability even if some truth values are true in the truth table then it is satisfiable so but in case of tautology you, you cannot have just some truth values as true for a tautology a compound proposition must have all the truth values as true so therefore i can say that all the tautologies are satisfiable but not every satisfiable is a tautology then next comes valid and invalid that means we are talking about the validity and invalidity so a compound proposition is valid when it is a tautology a compound proposition is valid when it is a tautology so what what kind of a compound proposition is valid which is a tautology so that means i can say from here i can uh, say that a tautology is both satisfiable and valid what is invalid or what is invalidity a compound state proposition is invalid when it is either a contradiction or it is a contingency so that means both contradiction and contingency are invalid now let us look at a summary of what all we have studied in this lecture so we can precisely say 
that we have a tautology we have a contradiction and we have a contingency so looking at the three of these compound propositions we will see what all properties all these three compound propositions have so a tautology is always true and a contradiction is always false and a contingency is sometimes true and sometimes false right so these are the three properties of uh, these are the properties of tautology contradiction and contingency that a tautology is always true a contradiction is always false and a contingency is sometimes true and sometimes false then a tautology is always satisfiable a contradiction is unsatisfiable fiable because it does not have even a single true truth value in its truth table then a contingency is also satisfiable because it has some true truth values in its truth table then a tautology is always valid a contradiction is always invalid as we just saw and a contingency is always also always invalid so this is the summary of what we have started in today's lecture tautology contradiction contingency tautology always true contradiction always false contingency sometimes true sometimes false tautology always satisfiable contradiction unsatisfiable contingency satisfiable then tautology is always valid contradiction is invalid and contingency is invalid